Let's find three equivalent fractions for four twelfths. And what we want to do, we want to find fractions that are equal to four divided by 12. They have the same decimal value. It's just that their numerator and denominator are different. So for four twelfths, I think we can just reduce this. Four goes into 12 three times. So we'll divide four by four. That gives us one. And 12 divided by four, that gives us three. So one third, that's an equivalent fraction to four divided by 12. Four twelfths, if you divide four by 12 or one by three, you get the same decimal. Let's find another equivalent fraction for four twelfths. Instead of division up here, we could use multiplication and we could multiply four twelfths by one. Well, that would just give us four twelfths. What if we multiplied it by two over two? Because two divided by two, that's just one. It doesn't change the value, just the way it's represented. Because four times two is eight, and then 12 times two is 24. So 24, that's another equivalent fraction for four twelfths. Let's do one more. So here we multiplied by seven over seven, which is just one. We end up with 28 eighty fourths. That's another equivalent fraction. So all of these, four twelfths, one third, eight twenty fourths, and 28 80 fourths, they are equivalent. They have the same decimal value. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.